a top technician leaves WWE. I'm Matt Carlins, and this is Just Pro Wrestling News for Friday, February 25th, 2022. This update is brought to you by IndieWrestling.us. That's Indie with a Y. WWE. Cesaro is a free agent. His contract with WWE expired after more than a decade with the company. PW Insider was the first to report this. Cesaro's contract expiring means there is no non-compete for him to wait out. He can work for anyone he wants, starting now. WWE says the SmackDown women's title match between Charlotte Flair and Ronda Rousey will main event night one of WrestleMania. Despite landing on his head during his match against Drew McIntyre at Saturday's Elimination Chamber pay-per-view, Madcap Moss is set for a rematch on Friday's SmackDown. Tonight's NXT Level Up has Jack of Time vs. Joe Gacy and Harland, Zion Quinn vs. James Drake, and Saray vs. Electra Lopez. Mustache Mountain is still the NXT UK Tag Team Champions. They turned away the challenge of Ashton Smith and Oliver Carter on Thursday's episode. Also on the show, Amel beat Zaya Brookside and Rohan Raja beat Danny Jones. AEW. The TNT Championship is on the line on tonight's Rampage. Sammy Guevara defends against Andrade El Idolo. Also tonight, a Face of the Revolution ladder match qualifier between Orange Cassidy and Anthony Bowens. Plus, another five-minute rookie challenge with Serena Deeb. And AEW Women's Champ Dr. Britt Baker and Thunder Rosa sign the contract for their title match at Revolution. Fightful reported on Thursday that AEW has picked up its option year on Brian Cage's contract. Cage later tweeted he doesn't know who told this to Fightful, but the website is standing by its story. And Helico tweeted on Thursday that he's been out of action with a torn ACL in meniscus. He says the injuries happened late last year, but he added that his recovery is well ahead of schedule. Impact Wrestling. We have four new matches announced for Impact's Sacrifice Special on March 5th. The Good Brothers will defend the Impact Tag Titles against Violent by Design's Eric Young and Joe Doring. The Good Brothers are back in Bullet Club. At least that's the word from Jay White, still referring to himself as the leader of Bullet Club. He says kicking out the Gorillas of Destiny was, quote, strictly business, end quote. Eddie Edwards says he simply turned his back on those who turned their backs on him when he betrayed Impact and helped Honor No More secure its place in the company. Edwards also gave his wife, Alicia, an ultimatum to join him and his new family or stick with Impact. Edwards is now set to face Rhino at Sacrifice. Honor No More is on a roll. Matt Taven, Mike Bennett, and Kenny King beat Rich Swan, Willie Mack, and Chris Sabin in the main event on Thursday's Impact. The other new matches announced for Sacrifice. Moose, defending the Impact World Championship against Heath, and Jonah will face PCO. Jonah beat Zicky Dice on Thursday's Impact. And Matt Cardona is still the digital media champion. He beat Jordan Grace in a dot combat match. Deanna Perrazzo held another open challenge and held on to AAA's women's title with a win over Lady Frost. Plus, Bupinder Gujar beat John Schuyler. On before the Impact, Ace Austin and Speedball Mike Bailey beat the X Division champion Trey Miguel and the number one contender Jake Something. Austin pinned Something. Violent by Design's Diener has re-signed with Impact. GCW has a pair of shows in Los Angeles this weekend. Friday night, it's Welcome to Heartbreak with the return of Sean X-Pac Waltman. He tags with Joey Janela against Matt Cardona and Brian Myers. Saturday night, it's the coldest winter with Mascara Dorada versus Gringo Loco and Thunder Rosa versus Tony Deppen. This week's episode of NWA Power premieres on YouTube tonight at 6 p.m. Eastern. Camille defends the NWA Women's World Championship against Taryn Terrell. Plus, Colby Carino versus Rhett Titus in a two out of three falls match and Chelsea Green versus Kenzie Page. New Japan Pro Wrestling. The Strong Openweight Championship is on the line on Saturday's New Japan Strong. Filthy Tom Lawler defends the title against Taylor Rust. Also on the show, Matthew Raywalt vs. El Phantasmo and Carl Fredericks vs. Ethan HD. New Japan announced Gabriel Kidd is returning to the United Kingdom and taking a leave of absence due to health issues. 
That is just Pro Wrestling News for Friday, February 25th. Enjoy your weekend and be sure to subscribe to this feed so you do not miss our next update. I'm Matt Carlins. Thank you for listening. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.